So, it was at this point, I realized something was wrong. Why is January Tyrone standing still? I thought they were laying it out. I don't like being watched. Too much time has passed, and I immediately knew what was going on. Tyrone's not lagging out. He's actually infinitely stuck opening these doors here. It's a glitch that can happen when you're opening the door. You just freeze up like this. And January over here, she was kind of moving in a way that made me think that she was uh, DC, but she wasn't. I noticed I couldn't uh, connect a grab to Tyrone. But I can move him. So, what I'm trying to do is move the poor bastard to uh, the exit gate because I know he's still there. He's just literally frozen inside his own, his own body. This is probably what it feels like to be paralyzed by the uh, pufferfish poison. I confess, I did not expect to be so. So everybody's just watching right now. And the zombies, they seem to be tracking Tyrone, but I don't know, they're probably just too stupid. They just they just don't know. And then they go after the other survivors. And this is where I noticed something interesting. Tyrone's able to move. So if you see this happening to one of your fellow survivors, do something like a rocket launcher, a grenade, or something like that to force them into a stagger animation. This will probably help them out. That's cursed. That's extremely cursed. But yeah, use something to stagger them out of that animation. The infinite door lock un unlocking animation. <laughs> 